Ready? You ready? Yeah. All right. My name is Joey Flores, and we are Airbits Radio. <laughs> Might not look like it, but I used to manage $60 million in marketing for lower my bills. In 2005, I met you, Tom. He graduated Mac and come out from Berkeley College of Music, and in 2007, we started a band. We got great reviews and were asked to play with two-time Grammy winners Arrested Development. We started doing all the things that bands do these days to market themselves, and what we figured out is, there are 12 million artists right now worldwide who can sell their t-shirts, concert tickets, and albums online, and they're still passing out flyers like it's 1985. <laughs> there are hundreds of marketing services for bands, but they basically sell pipe dreams of going viral or potential exposure. We wasted $30,000 trying all of them. <laughs> Thousands of record labels and live music venues still use print advertising for music, and I'm curious, how do these bands sound to you? <laughs> Meanwhile, Pandora has 150 million users who hate listening to commercials. They lost $20 million last quarter alone, mostly from crippling royalties, and if they ever want to be profitable, it's time for more commercials. I think that model sucks. <laughs> so, in 2010, Yutama and I found Ben Bryant. He's a strong technologist with a background in finance, and we started Earbits. On Earbits, bands, labels, and concert promoters waive their royalties and bid for airtime on a per stream basis. Then they use that guaranteed consumer exposure to market their live, their live events, their new releases, and to acquire new fans. With 15 songs sold every hour, we can monetize six to nine times better than Pandora with no ads, no commercials, and huge margins. Everybody told us when we started the company there were all these reasons it was never going to work, why we'd be unsuccessful without an audience, we would get no bands. Without the bands, we couldn't get an audience, and uh, you know the labels were never going to work with us. <laughs> Investors were never going to touch us. Well, fast forward to today, we raised seven hundred. Technically, we raised another hundred thousand dollars more. So we raised eight hundred thirty thousand dollars <laughs> from Y Combinator, Charles River Ventures, Jeff Ralston from Music Startup Lala, which was sold to Apple. We have 270 of the best independent record labels streaming on Earbits royalty free. That's 5,000 artists, including Bjork, Primus, Widespread Panic, 311, dozens of Grammy winners and platinum artists. We're talking heavy hitters. We've streamed 8.5 million songs since the first of this year to 800,000 unique visitors. We haven't spent a dollar on consumer marketing. And the thing that people told us the most was like, fans don't have any money. So we started selling airtime in March at an $11 CPM, and bands are buying an average package price of 65 bucks. 10% of those bands are buying unlisted packages from us, up to $400, and we have a 58% renewal rate. What's most exciting to us is not all these facts and figures, but the fact that these bands are not sitting out there begging people to listen to their music, and they're not putting flyers on your car windshield. Okay? <laughs> These bands have gotten tens of thousands of fans, mailing list signups, and other tangible results from Earbits, and all they did was give us their music and $65. When 128,000 of the world's 12 million bands give us $65 a month, we'll have $100 million in annual revenue from airtime sales alone, plenty of other revenue streams we can tap into. And do you know how we know we'll get 128,000 bands to give us their music at $65 a month? Because if you ask every single one of those 12 million bands what their hardest problem is, they'll tell you that it's marketing. And if you ask every record label and every live music venue what their hardest problem is, it's marketing. And if you ask any artist who's tried Earbits what works for marketing, they'll tell you it's Earbits. So, if you're interested in working with us and backing a team who consistently achieves what everyone else says is impossible, <laughs> please come talk to us. We are raising money. Thanks.